A typical day on a typical motorway, but we're moving ever closer towards a connected and autonomous future. It's going to transform the mobility industry. Whether they're being made by established manufacturers or tech companies, by 2020, three quarters of new cars will be able to connect to the internet, other cars and fixed infrastructure. By 2030, 15% of new cars could be fully autonomous. The industry is moving fast. We'll have fully autonomous cars on the road within five years. Next year, Volvo will actually trial autonomous cars on London and Gothenburg streets. While in August, as part of a $300 million partnership with Uber, it began testing a fleet of self-driving cars in Pittsburgh. The technology will bring significant changes. Firstly, there should be fewer accidents because, although there have been crashes involving semi-autonomous vehicles, on a mile-for-mile -mile basis, they've already proven to be significantly safer than regular cars. Horiba Mara does research, engineering and testing worldwide for, amongst others, the automotive industry. Here, they're convinced that trend will only move in one direction. Once you get vehicle-to-vehicle -vehicle communication, so that vehicles as they move around in a swarm are communicating with all of the vehicles around them, the ability to avoid collisions goes up dramatically. So I think we're very clear that, that the safety on the roads will improve. As the accident rate drops, so will insurance premiums and liability for accidents will move away from drivers. Somebody in the vehicle who has no impact on what happens with that vehicle, then there's absolutely no way that they could be held responsible in, in the world of the future. Thatcham Research tests new vehicle technologies for the insurance industry. And here it's easy to see how the driver dynamic is changing. If I'm distracted, it will automatically brake for me and warn me to brake so I don't uh, have a collision. Today, 87% of motor insurance policies lie with the driver. By 2060, that could drop down to 40%. And there's various models being discussed whether the vehicle manufacturers will take liability, whether it's more about product liability, or whether the insurers will certainly need to take some sort of liability. Octotelmatics helps insurers assess risk and claims through advanced data analytics, data that will play an ever-increasing role when it comes to assessing liability in the future. We're going to need to know, in the autonomous driving scenario, precisely what happened and who did what when. It's difficult to quantify exact effects or predict an exact timeline. But one thing is becoming clear. Increased autonomy is certain to have a profound effect on not just accident rates, liability and the insurance industry, but the entire motor industry itself. <laughs>